Hey guys and gals, this is Army Mac One, aka Michelle. I've got a revenge raid, player eight four one five. Um, I did a few searches on YouTube, but there wasn't anything with a lot of detail. So this base has fifty two boxes. There's no way I can show it all to you in one part. So I'm I went ahead and made a map and a loot table of every single box what it has in it so hopefully you can understand my map the stone walls the all the walls are stone you're not gonna get through any walls without c4 so be prepared I'll attach the map and the loot tables at the end of this video there's a lot of interesting things in this space uh, the only things that I'm going after are in two specific boxes. Other people might have other interests, which is perfectly okay, but I'm specifically going for guns and puppy food. But there is a ton of stuff. Please check out the end towards the end of the video, and it'll show you everything that you need to know. So... On the map, I've put it on there. There's a little sound trap by that door. Be careful where you drag your monsters, your, your zombies. I'm going to go ahead and break into here because I only brought two C4. And I'm going to a very specific location. This will pop the first wave. I'm going to use as many of my spike traps as possible so I can save some guns. And like I say, spike traps and band-aids are easier to come by than SWAT gear and guns. So use them wisely. I'm going to wait for them to come here. Okay. I don't want to drag them by that, that sound trap. If I can avoid it. And cut over. It'll get them close to the spike traps. Almost. They should be dead. Should be. Yep, yep, yep. No guns necessary. I like it. Okay, now specifically, I need to get into this room. I think it was this one. Yes, this room. It's only a two by one, but what's in there is very, very important to me. It's where all the guns are. It's in the center core of the base. So bring two C4 if you want to get good guns. I mean, there's some zip guns scattered throughout the base, but if you want the the good ones, you're going to spend some time on those C4s. Come on. We're going to bring you around this way, and then we're going to drag you back across the spike traps, guys, because I know you like them as much as I do. Hmm. <laughs> And then I'm going to cut across and cut in. If I, I'm going to go ahead and shoot this guy. Apparently I'll shoot two. Okay, like I said, this is a two by one. There's only one chest in here, but this is the good stuff right here, guys and gals. Good stuff. Yeah, buddy. So before I take all that stuff, I'm going to break into the chest that I need, which is going to be this one, because look at this lovely, all that puppy food that I don't have to go farm. I'm all for that. When you work full time and a lot of extra days because of the end of summer, you need all the puppy food you can get. So, yeah, you get a VSS, a Colt Python, a shotgun, two AKs, two M16s, 
seven glocks and an electronic circuit. I'm going to go ahead and put some of this in the chopper. And this base does have gas. It's in the room adjacent to the one with the puppy food. But like I said, I, I have different priorities than most people right now. So I would suggest looking at the loot tables, looking at the map, and deciding where you're going to go. Don't waste your materials if you don't need to. And I wish I could take, ooh, I can take some more puppy food. I'm going to do that. And take that. I kind of want to, I'm going to take a full AK. I can modify them later on. Well, actually, no, I'm going to do that. I, I can recycle it that. And, you know, puppy food's important, but gun recycling. Oh, my gosh. I'm still only level 37, I think. So, yeah. Where did I park? So, I'm going to talk you a little bit through it. Over in this room... There's three chests right here. One, two, three. You've got like over 40 cans of gas in one of them. I think it's that one. You've got four engine parts in there and like, I don't know, nine wrenches or something right there. Uh, I broke a few chests open. I'll show you. If you need food, bandages, first aid kits, this is the room for you. Uh, Lots and lots. There's so many. Just check out the loot tables. All right. I'm going to attach everything here at the end. Hopefully the video editor software that I got will work out good. And uh, let me know what you thought. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned. Bye. All right, guys and gals. Here's the map for player 8415. The patch is 1.9.6, and this is a revenge raid, but most of this stuff did not come from me. I highlighted everything that I did not take, but I found of interest in pink, and there's only two boxes that I'm going for in yellow. The 37 has all the guns, and 51 has all the raw meat. So here is the legend so you know what is everything marked on the map that has like initials in it and stuff these are all the boxes there was a total of 52 and there's some good stuff in the truck if you don't bring anything with you I guess I would suggest going into this room if you've only got one C4 with boxes 25 through 34 34 is marked out along with a few others that are completely empty. Just beware that this symbol by 52 is a sound trap. So be careful where you drag monsters by. So yeah, here's my map. Sorry for the bad handwriting. Hopefully you can read it. And now for the loot tables. So like I said, I highlighted everything in pink that I found of interest. Here is everything that's in every single box. This took a long time to put together, so I hope it, it was helpful. And you can pause or rewind if you have any questions feel free to put a, a message down in the in the comments and I'll answer you so yeah overall base loot tables again don't forget you can pause to look at everything again and I'm gonna call this good all right, y'all. Thanks for watching. Have a good day. Bye.